The little boy is identified as Stephen Pierce of Eddyville, Kentucky. Jackson County EMA says he was out on the water with his family when he was swept away. It only took two minutes Sunday for the water to rise to dangerous levels. Earlier this morning, several agencies returned to the site. Pierce's body was pulled from the water at 7:12 a.m. downstream from where he went missing. Now, over the past 24 hours, Jackson County EMA says 64 people had to be helped, 14 of those requiring a swift water or rope evacuation. In 2017, two people died, 40 others had to be rescued. Because of that incident, there was talk of an updated warning system. This morning, authorities say they're still researching possible solutions. It's unfortunate anytime you have any kind of fatality, um, children are, are very hard. That's not a case that us, especially the family, um, ever wants to endure. So it's been a tough day for everyone involved. Authorities say the little boy was not wearing a life jacket, and of course, that's a simple precaution they urge everyone to take. Reporting from Cummins Falls State Park, Mara Siriani, News 2.